Once a group is created, right-click and select Entity Info. Enter a name for the group. In this case, I named the group Crate. Once a name is given to the group in the Entity Info window, that group will appear in the Animation Path window. To assign a group to a specific path, select the path and enter the Animation Path window. By checking the box next to Crate, the group will now animate along the path. The interface allows for multiple groups to animate along a single path. The camera will be stationary wherever it is positioned before the animation is previewed or the scenes are created. In some animations, there may be a need for one object to animate after or slightly before another object has finished animating. I want the truck to drive off just before the crate is fully raised and the doors to open for the truck. Since the path for the crate has 150 frames, I've set the delay on the truck path to 130. In order for the truck to not crash into the doors, I have set the delay on the door paths to 190. You can either work out the math with all the different groups and paths involved, or you can preview the animation and change the delay until the doors open without the truck driving through them. After previewing the animation, everything seems to be smooth and the truck doesn't drive through the closed doors. All that is left to do is create the final scenes and export the animation.